And looking ahead, we can learn today if charges will be brought against a school resource officer after video showed him slamming a student to the ground. This is a story that is getting national attention. And today, the Vance County District Attorney is expected to address this case. CBS 17's Jamise Price joining us live right now outside Vance County Middle School. That's where this took place. Jamise. And Bill, the Vance County District Attorney Mike Waters said the extent of the injuries of this 11-year-old could determine if charges are filed. Now, we had the opportunity to speak with the family of the 11-year-old student and the grandfather. John Miles said this video was tough to watch. He watched the video, though, with tears in his eyes, and he saw as his grandson was slammed to the ground twice and dragged briefly down the hallway. The grandfather says his grandson only weighs 70 pounds and he was knocked unconscious during this ordeal. The deputy was fired Monday. The SBI is investigating, but Miles says he still hasn't been told why the officer was interacting with his grandson in the first place. He could have killed my grandson, could have paralyzed my grandson. So I, I, me right now, I forgive, but I never forget this here. And I'm asking, and I believe my heart with the, um, the DA here, um, a great, he's a great DA. I believe my heart that, um, that they will be bringing charges. Miles says his grandson will not return here to Vance County Middle School. The parents are looking at homeschooling or other options, maybe even taking him out of the school district. Coming up in the next half hour, you're going to hear from the school district and how they are responding to this ordeal. Live in Vance County, Jamise Price, CBS 17 News.